everyone, Mrs. Cross here. We are going to talk about how to carve our design into our pots today and also carve our names and class period on the bottom. Sorry I couldn't be with you today, but we're gonna do this on the video. All right, so I've got my pot here and it's leather hard. The reason I can tell that it's leather hard are a couple things. When I try to squeeze it, it's not moving, okay? Now it's still cold to the touch, but it's not really moving around. The best time to do this carving is when it's leather hard. Leather hard is the best time to do this and I've already carved a little bit into this pot. So I'm gonna show you what you're gonna need to do this next step. In the top drawer on the left-hand side in the back where we have all our tools, we have these things and they're called styluses. And basically what it is, is a sharpened wooden dowel rod. That's all it is. And there again, they're on the top drawer in the back on the left-hand side. So you can grab one of these. I also like to have a paintbrush, a dry, clean paintbrush. And those are located below the television in a cup on a shelf okay so you'll see them right below the television you can look back there now they are in those cups so you can grab a clean dry paintbrush all right so i have my design and i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to start to carve it in so i've carved one of these already i'm going to put another one on here so maybe i'll just turn it around to the other side okay and i'm going to put it here so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just gently draw this design onto my pot. Now, I'm just gonna make this really faint. And what I mean by faint is very light. I'm trying not to dig into this too much. And the reason for that is, is if I mess up, I can just erase this with my finger instead of having to add clay back to it. So I'm gonna keep drawing. put some chunky eyelashes on here. I'm, I like to make eyeballs on my work. Now you'll see that I'm getting lots of little pieces of clay that are coming off of here. And that is where our paintbrush is gonna come in handy. We're gonna get those off of the clay. And it's really important that we take those off because they will be very sharp if we do not. So I can take my paintbrush and I can just brush those away, okay? All right, I got my design. Now, if I like this and I am wanting to keep this, then I can go ahead and I can start to carve a little bit deeper. So I'm gonna take my tool and instead of being straight up and down like this on my pot, I'm gonna kind of hold it like a pencil. And I'm just going to start to carve into this. You'll see I'm getting more and more goobers on here. I can take my paintbrush, I can knock those down. Oops, go over it if I need to. All right, you bring it back to the center here. Carve my eyelashes. You put some lines in here. For this first pot, you wanna keep the design pretty simple. Make sure that it's school appropriate. You should have done some designs already, drawn them out. Remember when we did those five designs. Choose one of those, okay. So I'm gonna get my paintbrush, brush it away. That looks pretty good. I'm gonna go over any areas that have any little goobers in them. I want all those little boogers 
All those little clay goobers out. All right, that's pretty deep. Looks pretty good. All right, now that I'm finished with my pot, I'm going to flip it over and I'm going to get my name on the bottom of this. I'm gonna use the bottom outside to put my name on this. I'm gonna put my full name and my class period. So my name is Lisa Cross. And you can read that, I can read it well. And then class period for you guys, 4C. All right. There we go. Now what we're gonna do is, we're just gonna go ahead and put these back into our plastic. So on Friday, I can look at them. Now don't wrap it in your towel, just in your plastic. And then on Friday, we'll finish them up. We'll finish any carving. I'll show you how to even out the rim, if you'd like to do that. And we'll finish our names and we'll be moving on next week to coiling. So go ahead and work on your carving today. Work on finishing up any uh, pinching that you need to do. Put your name on it. First and last 4C class period. And then on Friday, I'll take a look at them. Thanks guys.